Hey boys, what's poppin? Amber here. So the thing is, I have finally figured out how to change the language on the updated Lee client. I had a method in the past that I made a bunch of videos on, but sadly that doesn't work anymore. So I don't know what to say, guys. I did it again. This will be how to change your language to Korean in League of Legends. It's the middle of November. I don't see them changing this anytime soon. So these videos should be enough even for the next year. As you can see on the screen, this is a bot game with the language change applied. It looks exactly exactly like Korean servers so that's pretty slick we even got the same font that they have and all of that just a note uh here I'm playing on EU West and have also tested this for NA but it should work on any server you're playing on pretty much so you're good to go I'm also going to be showing you how to revert these changes back to your original language so don't worry about that in case you end up getting bored or end up disliking Korean for whatever reason all right so let's get into it all right so here we are on the desktop um just want to say make sure to like play Please follow my lead do not skip the video i know you just want to get to it but like there's some like little things that can mess this whole thing up so just don't skip the video and uh, i'll be like as fast as possible and i'll be like super clear i'm gonna open my league of legends real quick i'm playing on eu west which means my default language is english and yeah i'm using english so i'm just gonna log in real quick and show you guys uh, how my client looks like just so you can see uh, most of you are probably using English as well, so it is going to look pretty similar. Yeah, everything seems to be working fine. Now, what we are going to do is we are going to make sure our Riot client, everything is like fully closed. So many of you that are watching right now probably already have League or Riot client open in the background. So what you want to do is uh, close League, make sure to sign out and then go to your task manager. Uh, this will pop up and close that as well. Uh, you should see Riot Client right here at the bottom. Make sure to close it and go to your task manager and check if uh, your Riot Client is um, running. Um, mine is not currently, so I can just close my task manager. So that's the first step. Make sure that your Riot Client is not running at all. Otherwise, none of this uh, will work. So yeah make sure your right client is closed alrighty so now that we've uh, done the first step which is uh, once again really important make sure right client is closed fully we want to find our League of Legends directory and that's pretty easy actually easiest way you could do that is by right clicking on uh, your League of Legends shortcut go to properties open file location and it will bring you here to the right client thingy uh, this is not where we want to be though, so we want to click on Riot Games, backtrack one step and uh, you'll find the League of Legends folder and this is basically the OG League of Legends directory. If for whatever reason you don't have a shortcut of uh, Riot Client or League of Legends, just go to like my computer or whatever. Um, I have mine in C, uh, it should just say Riot Games, that should be the folder and then League of Legends and here we are this is where we need to be which brings us to step three of course so once we're in the League of Legends directory local disk C or whatever whichever you installed your own a Riot Games League of Legends you want to scroll down until you see League Client .exe. it's probably not going to say exe unless you have uh, file extensions enabled like me so you can see them but it doesn't matter what you want to do to this League Client is right click it and uh, create a shortcut very important do not do this step on league client you have to create a shortcut so what we want to do now is uh, right click the league client shortcut and click on properties then we'll be brought to this little property box we want to make sure it's a league client shortcut right uh, go to the target box go all the way to the right so all the way to the right there is a little quotation mark here so make sure it's just uh, beyond that and now make one space it has to be one space, not two, not three, just one. Two lines, just like this. And then locale equals, for Korean, it's um, small letters KO. So KO small underscore KR. Before you click on apply, um, well, <laughs> before you click on apply, make sure to double check it. Um, make sure there's one space here. Uh, two lines or dashes or whatever they're called locale equals ko small letters underscore kr uh, capital letters and then click on ok so now what we need to do is right click this shortcut once we will need this later 
but right click it once and run as an administrator and it should open our lead client i believe so let's just wait for that uh it will also be downloading the korean voice files and text and whatever i don't know let me go ahead and log in real quick we go moment of truth and there we go we it is in korean so this is just the launcher but we'll also check the game here on the video everything is changed so good luck unless you uh, speak korean but not gonna lie korean league looks pretty fucking sick so let's get into the game um we'll get into the practice tool this is not practice tool this is practice tool we are so far so good i don't understand much so forgive me oh the voice lines are here as you can see just want to hear the announcer and that's there you go and the korean font as well everything works just fine so that's perfect Alrighty, so as you guys have seen everything works just fine um now you can just go ahead and launch your league from the normal league shortcut that you have or from the right client except the right client will also be in korean as you can see here so that's one downside i guess so everything is going to be in korean unfortunately this is the only way this way you get the voices like the whole thing the whole experience anyways as i promised i'm also going to show you how to revert these changes back to your default language what we need to do is basically uh kind of do the same thing so this also goes for any language whether that is korean japanese it doesn't matter what language you have it now i'm gonna show you how to change it back to your default language so make sure to close your launcher fully um make sure to also close the riot client so once again open your task manager riot client should be somewhere here let me go ahead and find it there it is make sure you end it so it's fully gone even from your system trade that you probably cannot see right now because i'm there he what we want to do is go back to our league directory i already showed that in the previous step so you can uh, scroll the video back and find it backtrack from riot games to league of legends we'll still have the shortcut we've made of the league client uh we want to right click the same shortcut and click on properties now you can search these codes up i was using english and instead of k-o-k-r i will have e-n small underscore capital g b so this is the code for english you can uh, find these codes on google it's pretty easy i'll click on apply so all i had to change was ko underscore kr that i had previously because i had the korean version of the game um to en gb for english en underscore gb i'll click on k i'll uh launch the lead client shortcut as an administrator now it should open in english here we go username password perfect i'll just sign in just to uh, uh, show you guys and there we go it's back to english perfect so there you guys have it that is how to change your league of legends language to korean currently is the only way i will be making the same video for japanese chinese and english so if you're interested in that make sure to subscribe i will literally post all of these videos in like the span of uh three to four days max so don't worry you won't miss them just click on the bell and whatnot Hope that helped you out. If it didn't work out for you, just rewatch the video carefully. As I said, do not skip through. All these steps are pretty important, no matter how small they seem, to make this work. I know it's a bit of a hassle, but hey man, sometimes it takes a bit of work to get what you want. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.